So of course, we're going to have to open the Xbox, see what condition it is in on the inside, see how much dust we have. And so it's as it's, it's clean as possible when it goes to my wife's son. We're going to replace his Xbox One X with his Xbox One S. It's not a big difference really, but his Xbox One X is not feeling very well. I mean, the power supply is starting to go out on it, so we replace it with this, so he has something to play. screws yeah it's dust let's see lift this up and this part is not that dusty supply and a bit of dust. So now everything is put back together and let's see if it works. So Amara is all set up, so let's push the button. This makes a sound. Let's see if we get a display. Come on now. Oh yeah. Is what we wanted to see. Well, I really have forgotten how slow it is with a hard drive. Okay, so it's signing me in. And now I have downloaded Rocket League because it didn't take long. So now we're going to see if the disk drive works. I don't have any Xbox games, so I'm just try with a Blu-ray movie. It takes it in really nicely. And come on, it's reading. Come on. Oh yes. As usual with Xbox, you need to install this. Little add on for the Blu ray player. You don't have to do that on PlayStation. Wow. 
Ow! This is not good. So that one took forever, so let's screw it. He doesn't have any physical games, so let's just see if it plays Rocket League. nicely. So the Xbox is running beautifully. The ran Rocket League perfectly fine. No issues. Did not even... See, ah, it did get... It's a little bit warm but everything works. It runs nicely and the controls will be in a separate video on its own. I think it was a good buy for $32. And they go for pretty penny on eBay like 150-160 bucks. So I'm happy with it. It's a bit slow, but what can you expect from an old hard drive? But it will be perfectly suitable. That's it for this time. I hope you have enjoyed it. Please leave a like if you did and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you all very soon in the next one.